Hello, this is Matt from tracyandmatt.co.uk and from unboxings.com. Looking here at the Logic 3 iStation podium. Now there are a whole raft of docks and uh, speaker arrangements for uh, iPods and the iPhone, but not too many. In fact, this is the first I've seen for the iPad, and this is an iPad speaker dock. So we're going to have a look at that right now, see what's inside the box, and see what it's all about. So first of all, let's unbox that. And inside, the first thing we see uh, is a couple of uh, user guides. So there's an app user guide, because there is an installable app for it. And then there's the actual guide, user guide for the speakers and the stand, which tells us how the arrangement works, how it fits in, power, and all that kind of stuff. So on the side, we have a mains adapter there, so it has got like that kind of bullet style connector there. And then a couple of different, well, there's a European and a UK power connector for it. That's all on the outside, so pull off these pieces of cardboard on either side and open up. We have there we go that's the podium itself so this basically stands up like so it goes that way round and this portion here does rotate and that's pretty cool because see when we pop our iPad inside like so clip it at the top uh, we can use it in this arrangement, or we can use it in that arrangement. See if I turn off the auto rotate, screen will rotate too. That's pretty cool. And then we can adjust it to different angles, so we can make it stand up a little higher, or we can make it lay quite flat. If we just swing that around. You can see that there's the mechanism on the back, which allows for this arrangement, and as it says here, fixed position, don't adjust. Uh, so on the back, well, bottom portion, they have the speakers, so it's obviously stereo speakers, on either one on either side. As you can see there, there is a, what looks like a sort of a subwoofer you know, port there, um, although it's not massively powerful in, uh, in actual terms. Uh, on the bottom, underneath, you can see there, is the, where we plug in the power connector. There is also a line-in connector and uh, looks like a little LED there to actually uh, as an indicator and also looks like a little reset next to that. Uh, that's really all there is. There isn't a great deal here. I mean there's obviously this clip mechanism at the bottom which holds the iPad in place uh, which is quite cool and uh, well, on the front here power and basically what, uh, effectively power and an up and down, I assume an up and down volume control. Uh, I'd imagine, but that's really it in terms of sort of like the connectors and mechanism and everything else. Uh, so really quite simple, but kind of elegant, and it does look kind of quite neat. And I do like the fact that you can actually use it in either orientation. Um, I hope that we're going to see sort of a bit more of a um, uh, competitive market for for the iPad um, speaker docks and you know actually docking accessories because um, uh, I think it's much. But I think it's a really cool um, thing for the iPad actually. Um, because the iPad does lend itself to being a, a, you know, a very good little you know, media center type device. So uh, hopefully we'll see some more. But this is pretty cool. Um, one of the first, as I say. Uh, it's two two speaker arrangements. So it's 2.0 speaker uh, arrangement. It's 4 watts, which isn't massive amounts, but it's, it's probably loud enough for a small speaker. As I say, 3.5mm uh, line-in connector on the side there, um, on the bottom or the side, depending on obviously your orientation. Um, which allows you to use it with uh, other accessories if you want to. Um, it, obviously the rotate will allow it to work in either way, but it also only rotates 90 degrees, not for 180. Um, <coughs> adjustable footrest on the back, and so say you can adjust the angle that you actually orient the uh, iPad when it's in operation. Uh, dimensions, well it's uh, listed here at 26 uh, centimeters wide, 26 centimeters tall approximately. Uh, and sort of a depth from front to back of 12 centimeters. Um, the app that comes with it, or that you can download and install on your iPad, 
has a feature for clock, uh, calendar, internet radio, alarm functions with a voice recorder, uh, a sleep function, weather, and a graphic equalizer. So that's pretty cool. Uh, I'm going to take this away now. Uh, pop, pop it on uh, on power. Actually, plug it in. Uh, see how it works. Take a look at the app. I'll do a full review for you with some screenshots of the app and the arrangement and how it all works and tell you how tell you what it sounds like uh, and what we think of it. A full review for you will be up uh, within the next week or so on tracyandmatt.co.uk. Uh, if you want to follow us on Twitter, it's twitter.com slash tracyandmatt or facebook, facebook.com slash tracyandmatt.co.uk. Uh, we'll be back some, soon with some more videos and reviews on tracyandmatt.co.uk, but for now, thanks for watching. Bitdefender is dedicated to protecting people's digital lives, so working with Unboxings.com to help preview and review the latest technology is a perfect fit.